this is Nilanjan Ghosh from Informatica Global Customer Support and today I'm going to talk about how to configure a web service workflow to run continuously in PowerCenter 9.x and 10.x. So today's agenda would be to create a web service source and a target. Then we will be creating a mapping from the source and the target. We will create a web service workflow from the mapping and then configure the web service workflow to to be exposed as a web service workflow and then we will be configuring the workflow to run continuously and test it from the try it out option so let's get started so I have a folder and we are going to create a source and target So we are going to give web service hub test and we are going to create a source and a target. It will be a very simple source and a target and we'll click OK. We'll save it. Okay, so the target is also there. Now we'll create a mapping. WSH test and we'll drag the target over here we'll save the mapping now over here in the workflow manager we are going to create a workflow workflows create so wfk test wsh and we will enable it as a web service and it should be visible and runnable we'll click ok and we'll create a session from the mapping ok and we'll link both of them now we will be configuring the workflow to run continuously we'll go to the source and we will change the idle time to minus one and we'll also check if the workflow has the integration service okay it already has so the workflow is valid now okay now we are going to run um, the workflow And this workflow will run continuously un unless we abort or stop it explicitly and we are also going to try this workflow uh, from the try it out option on the web service hub console so here is the web service so let's see okay so we'll click on the valid web service and we'll try it out okay and we'll give it as a b c d and send okay so the status is success let's check on the workflow monitor now okay we'll abort this and we'll try it from the try it or op option so it's aborting okay stopped and we'll reset ABCD okay let's check from the workflow monitor so it's running and this is going to run continuously thanks for watching the video and we would love to hear from you you can email us at support videos at informatica.com and here is our Twitter handle thanks for watching the video